Emma, how are you? Do you know? <gasps> Hi, I, Emma, how are you? <laughs> I can't. I can't believe I had the speaker on. <laughs> I can't see the com the comments part, which is not good. Ah, uh, let me see. <laughs> you know, you made me jump, Emma, and actually, my own voice made me jump. Can you hear me? Okay. Um. It's uh... hey Lee, how are you? <laughs> hey, can you guys hear me all right? Oh, good, good, good. I'm used to being able to hear Paul, but uh, he'll be coming on shortly. Uh, but it just seems weird. Uh, it just seems weird because I can't hear myself. <laughs> and, um, hey, um, Emma, did I make you jump because the voice, like, I forgot to turn off the speaker on the other one. Hi, Grace. How are you? Do you know I can't even see this something? Facebook has done something different. Oh, my goodness. You're kidding. Okay. How are you, Grace? I, I don't think ever, you've been on before, Grace. I'm not sure if I've seen you on before. I might have to put it on here to see the comments. Oh, good. That's good. Okay, yeah, I can see the comments here. Wow. First time watching. Wow, fantastic. That's great. Welcome to our group. I should say actually welcome to our family. Hi, Becky. How are you? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Becky. I'm just going to share myself uh, as well, and then I'll be putting everybody's name down that has shared. Hi, Desiree. How are you? Oh, you like it, do you? If everyone that shares the live um, will go into this draw and I will select randomly throughout the live, and everyone that I select gets a free mini reading. Now, if you would like a guaranteed mini reading, you um, just need to make a donation. And I have pinned those details below in the comments. Paul is actually coming on in a few minutes. So you will actually get a reading from both of us. Um, so I'm just uh, sharing at the moment. Um, I better put it on Paul's page because he'll kill me. <laughs> he'll start moaning. I haven't put it on his page. Yeah, it's exciting, Desiree. Brace myself. <laughs> You're funny. It's a shame I can't. Um, I'll have to look at the comments from the. I'm interested to see how Paul sees his comments. Um, when he comes on because um, you can't, um, wow, it's already 13 shares. Thank you, everybody. So sorry, I feel like I'm being rude. <laughs> I don't like looking down. Hi, Samantha. Hi, Michelle. How are you guys? I hope you're all well. How are you, Samantha? Okay, where am I going here? No, I'm going over here. Um, 
Samantha, I don't think I've seen you on before. Um, the way it works here is if you share this live, I will place your name in a draw and I will actually um, be pulling out names throughout the live from the, um, the draw. And everybody's name stays in there throughout the whole live and we'll just add as people share. And if I pull out your name, you will receive a free mini reading from both myself and Paul. Um, and he's coming on shortly. And, uh, yeah, you and you'll be able to either come on live with us here or you will, uh, we can just do it in the comments for you. Um, or if you'd like a guaranteed mini reading, you can um, follow the donation details in the pinned comment below. Um, or if you'd like a private reading, you can message this page and let us know who you would like a private reading with and um, we can get that organised for you as well. Okay. Um, I'll just check on this other page, Michelle, because sometimes even if it doesn't come up on your sharer, I can see somewhere else. Wow, we've got a lot. Yes, Michelle, I can see that you've shared. And Samantha, um, just give me a moment, ladies. I'm just... Um, I am just sharing myself as well. Oops, this phone keeps turning off and going to the screensaver. <gasps> Hi, Hayley, how are you? Yes, I, it worked, Michelle. <laughs> how are you, Hayley? Yes, it, I love it how everyone helps each other to and tells everyone what to do to share. <laughs> it's lovely. I better get cracking and share myself. Paul should be on pretty soon now. So um, I'll just do that. Hi, Kathleen. Oh, my goodness. You're just doing a quick drop in. Okay. Are you at home or you're back in? I'm great, Hayley. How are you going? Oh, you said you're good. Sorry, I'm repeating myself. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, okay, I better quickly do this. Hang on. Make sure. Um, am I seeing this right? How did we get 52 shares all of a sudden? <laughs> you're at home. Okay. At least, like, are you feeling comfortable? All right, um, let me just quickly. Okay, I'm just waiting for Hay um, Paul to come on, Hayley. So, yeah, I remember you mentioned that, Kathleen. It just, it's not a very good run, is it? Um, I, I really hope, um, you know, things turn around for you. You'll have to ask him, Lee, when he comes on. <laughs> um, as far as I know, it's okay. Hi, Dana, how are you? Yeah. So it's a bit hard when, when, like, when they're not sure, isn't it, Kathleen? Yeah. So... <laughs> Paul will be on in about five minutes. <laughs> He's putting on his makeup. <laughs> I'm glad you're good. Oh, yeah, that's not good. Um, uh, I, 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 you know, uh, Paul and I were sending you healing energy as well. But, um, yeah, it's... Uh, I hope you've got um, some friends with you as well. Oh, yeah, yeah. I hope you've got some friends with you, Kathleen, that, you know, support around you. Um, uh, 
Okay. I'm just sharing some more. Yeah, it must have been you, Hayley. All of a sudden, there was all these shares. Everybody's done fantastic. Okay, so I'm going to start um, <clears throat> putting people into the draw. <sighs> really, Michelle? <laughs> I'm not that innocent. <laughs> I might look it. <laughs> you know what they say. <laughs> but thank you. Actually, a lot of people tell me that. Um. Thank you. That was really lovely of you to say that, Michelle. <laughs> hey, when Paul comes, tell him that because he, he reckons I'm not. <laughs> he doesn't think I am. <laughs> Paul, if you're listening, I look innocent. <laughs> no, but that's lovely, Michelle. Um, uh, where else was I sharing it? I forgot. <laughs> Uh, okay, there. It's so quiet. Yes, he. Yes, tell him that, Michelle. He is. He's the the little red devil. Yes. Oh, is Kathleen going? All right. See you, Kathleen. Good night. Oh, Paul, is that you? <laughs> That's not me commenting. That's Paul. <laughs> so, Paul, I've been told that I look innocent and you're you're the little red devil. So I'm going to remind you of that now. Every time. Good night, Kathleen. Thank you for popping by. It was lovely to see you. Come on. Okay, I'm getting through it. <gasps> Did he from fifth grade is going to middle school? Uh, you know, how many schools are there in the US? Like, is there like a junior, a middle, and then a senior? Is there? And then there's college, which would be, I think, like our university. For us, there's like a primary school, secondary school, and and then university, which I think you call college. So that's fantastic, though. How old is your son, Haley? Oh, my goodness, Dana. Wow, you're a gun. All of you are tonight. Thank you so much. I've just got a couple more. Okay, that's it for me. I know, I was thinking that, but um, if you put music on, they can shut, Facebook can shut you down. Um, and I was thinking of doing it because I, I prefer music, but um, I'm not sure. I would hate it, especially after everybody, 113, wow, that's amazing. All right, I'm going to put everyone's name that's shared now into the draw. Oh, my goodness, look at all these lovely people that have shared. I can see I have to look on my iPad because it's not working on the screen. That's fantastic. Hey, Michelle, maybe you can come on and do some singing. <laughs> you know what? I think there's someone that's coming on now that I think will be really good at singing. Oh, 
<laughs> What's wrong with you? Why have you got that face? Have Can you tell me, Paul, when you look at your comments on Facebook, are you able to see them? Am I able to see the people from Facebook? The, the comments. Because yeah. I'm getting this other thing that's coming up. Um, and I don't know why. I can see comments. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, no. Well, okay, I'm seeing some other comments now. Before I couldn't see anything. Okay. You talk to all the lovely people that have come on while I put their names in the drawer. Okay. Hello. Hope you're all well. Um, if all of a sudden Doesn't I start... you look handsome tonight? Sorry? I was just saying you look handsome. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Give it five minutes and I'll be laying on the... I'll be asleep. But uh, <laughs> no, thank you, everyone. Um, yeah, I, I, I was watching, and yes, you do look innocent every single time. Do I? Yes, yes, you do. You, you know, you well, I'm not going to say it anymore because you've already got it in your head that you're not. Or that I'm are. not. I bet you are. But but I'm going to say hello to Michelle and all the others. Um, I'm just going to nip through the through the comments. Um, That's okay. Michelle. I'm just doing putting people in the drawer now that have that have shared. Mm -hmm. uh, and Kathleen came on for a few minutes too. Oh hello! Oh she's gone. No no she's gone. She's not well and she's tired. But she came on and said hello. Hello. Um, Hayley. hello, Donna. Donna, um, who else? Susie. You should see all the shares they've done for us, it's been fantastic. I can see, thank you, thank you for that. Um, anyway, where are we? I'm going through. Uh, Becky, if she's still on, hello. Oh, I didn't uh, see Betty. Who? Becky. Oh, Becky. Oh, yes, I saw Becky. Not, not Betty. <laughs> <laughs> you know who's on? Are you still on, Emma? Emma uh, was on. Emma Gregory. Okay, okay. Are you still uh, on, Emma? Hang on a minute. Oh, who else? Uh, Lee. Hello, Lee. Oh. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh dear. Who else? Who else? Oh no, that's about as far as I can go up the page. Hi, right. Miriam. Where are we? I'm going to put you in the drawer, Miriam. You, you you say you're going to put people in the drawer all the time. You'll have no room in your drawers. <laughs> At least it's warm in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I've got a bit of a suntan. Yeah, I can see. Yeah, I've gone all red. Yeah, but... Uh, yeah, I, I do apologise. That wasn't on uh, first thing. Um, circumstances. Ooh. Hello, Paul Holmes. How are you? How's your mum? No, I haven't been to the hairdressers. It's just me, like, zoop, 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 and that's it. You've just zoop, 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 have you? Hi, Melissa. Hi, Cheryl. Um, <clears throat> Hello, Melissa. I would love to find a new job. Of course you would. Um, Cheryl, uh, everybody would like to find that, but look out and you might, yeah, <laughs> you might have a big surprise. <laughs> That's good. Um, we're glad your mum's doing very well. Um, and, uh, yeah, we're glad your mum's doing really well. And uh, I don't know if there are other people on previous, you know, in the last 15 minutes, but 
swallow them. I'm sorry, you missed me. <laughs> if you weren't, if you haven't stayed on. But uh, how's everyone's life at the moment? You know, how's your evening and how's your day? If you're in the UK or wherever you are in the in the states. But uh, did you keep them entertained, Savannah? I'm trying to th think. Is this going to fix it? What are you? Uh... Huh. I'm having issues with the comments. Sorry. Mm. Um, they, they were all really nice. We we're all thinking about maybe we should have some relaxation music in the background. Mm. I'm glad your mum's doing better, Paul. Yeah, it's, it would be nice, but I did catch that bit where you said Facebook had most probably shook us off. Yeah, I think um, there's something, I, I, I think I know how we can do it, but maybe next time when we come on. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Wow. Now this is going to be a problem here. Because um, I'm not getting all the comments. Oh no! Are you no, not getting? Any, I can't not... put love hearts now. All right, I'm going to have to do it from Streamyard, I think. Ah, right. Okay, I was just about to say it's the only place you can do it, isn't it? I know. Um, I like I like love hearting everyone. <laughs> <laughs> I go crazy. Um, no, the, the comments are a little bit slow. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to, I'm sorry, guys, I can't do love hearts. So <laughs> I love doing love hearts on everyone, but uh, I just can't, um, it won't let me. So um, the only thing is I have to have this on, otherwise I can't see if people have shared or not. No, there you go. <sighs> but uh, no, we're... Uh, you know, um, we're grateful to all of you that have turned up. And, uh, you know, I I don't know if uh, Silvana mentioned it, that we call everybody a family member. And, yes. Oh, that's good. That's good. Um, you know, everybody that you know, comes on and, you know, we don't treat anybody different. We treat everybody the same, not unless it's Silvana. What do you mean? <laughs> telling me oh, oh, no. I did a, a love heart on my own <laughs> I was trying to put a love heart on Michelle but it won't work <laughs> oh this is ridiculous what is going on <coughs> yeah there's a love heart come up yeah I wanted to you know when you can love or like somebody's comment uh -huh. uh, won't let me do it. Hmm. Ah, right. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah. Oh, hang on, uh, go. Did I no, do the, it? These comments are very slow, sluggish. Yeah, because all I'm seeing. <laughs> hey, I did one on Dana. Okay, I think I've got to do it that way. Um. I'm seeing eight minutes ago. Yeah, um, I'm gonna. I have to do it on my iPad because otherwise we won't be able to see what they're saying. Uh, well, I can't. We can through Streamyard, but um, not. So are you, you're having the same problem as me, right? It looks like it. So oh no! I, I've just I've I've just redone my page, and yeah. I've just got the latest one. Yeah, and that doesn't last long. Right, okay. Um, I'm trying to put a love heart on Miriam. Hang on, where's Miriam, Miriam? It won't let me. Where, where is Miriam? She just put yes with a blue love heart. Oh, hang on, can I do it? Can I do it? <gasps> I did it, Miriam, you got a love heart. All right, it's going to take me a while. I've got to do it from the iPad, which is a shame because that doesn't leave any room for the cards, does it? Nope. 
Oh, mamma no. mia, mamma mia, what is happening? <laughs> ah, dear, mamma mia. Yes. I've never actually watched that. Oh, the movie, no. Oh, I think, yeah, I think I'll watch it. I didn't, I don't know. But uh, I've put everyone into the draw so far that has shared. Thank you so much. Um, I don't think Emma's on. Oh, right, okay. Uh, oh, she was on before. Right. She must have just popped in to say hello. Just to say hello. 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 How are you? Yeah, fantastic. No, it doesn't look like it. Um, oh. Yeah, I did it, Miriam, but now I can't work out how I did it. <laughs> how do I do it? How did you do it? You don't know. Oh, no. What are no, you gonna because do? whenever I want to do it, <laughs> whenever I want to do it, it, it wants to delete that person's comment, but I don't want to do that. I don't know. You definitely don't want to do that. Hi, Lucretia. How are you? Um, I might have to. Uh, oh, this is ridiculous. Um, you know what you can do, Paul? What's that? Can you, if you go into StreamYard and then click on the, that first box that has comments or whatever, because you'll be yeah. able to see people's comments, and you I might have. That. I'm on. I'm on that bit. Yeah. You're on that bit. I'm on that bit. You're on that bit. Yeah. Hello, Lucretia. Uh, Having a bad day. That's not good. No. Um, hello, Lee, again. Um, it's freezing in Sydney. Cough. It's, um, I don't know what the temperature is here. Um, let me have a squeeze. No, sorry, I can't, it just won't let me do it. it it's 20 degrees here and bright sunshine. And it's going to get up to about 24 in the end. And then by the weekend, it's going to be 28, 27. So it's going to be nice. It's going to be really nice. Uh, Something like, I, I think I know how we can do it. But all right. It's going to be 28, 27. Yeah, Michelle's, Michelle's got to go and pick her son-in-law up soon. No, it's her son. A son. No, it's her law, son-in-law. No, oh, your son-in-law. I thought it was your son, Michelle. <laughs> I, I'm fine, Lucretia. Um, really no, nice. Well, I can't even say it. Nice weather. <laughs> Nice. <coughs> yep. Son-in-law. Meant to clarify that last time. But it uh, doesn't matter. Okay. There's no point in me having this on then if I can't do anything with the comments. No. Freezing uh, in Sydney. Now, who's Sydney? Sydney's New South Wales. No, I know. I know I'm joking. <laughs> nice, Paul Holmes. Nice. <laughs> ah, right. Our son in law works for Coles. Oh, Who it's are... your son in law. I kept thinking it was your son. Who are Coles? So he, he would be like your son anyway. Yeah. Um, yeah. I've just looked. I've just looked on my uh, Facebook and the. Uh, and ah, your son's a youth leader. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm still, I'm not getting the comments as I should be. Hey, Tisha. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine he would be like a son to you. Hello, Tisha. Um, blimey. God. 
So you good? You know, I'm, I'm fine. How are you then, Paul? I haven't um, asked you yet. Um, I do apologise. Um, He's being rude. Who's been rude? I don't know. <laughs> I'm never rude. I don't know. Did I say that? <laughs> yeah. Wow, Michelle. <laughs> I never, I'm never rude. Never, never. <laughs> um. Okay. Okay. Um. I suppose. I suppose I'm going to pull out a draw. Are we going to pull a bit of paper out as well, out the bowl? Yeah. There's a few people in there now. So oh. I can pull someone out. Well, yeah, I thought you said you were just going to pull out a drawer. You got some drawers? Yeah, he's a good kid. That's nice. That's nice, Maria. Nice. That's nice. <laughs> so, um, oh. okay, wow. I think I'm getting the hang of doing this on the iPad. All right. Okay, let's pull out a draw. Are you ready to rumble? Okay, here we go. Hello, uh, Renee. Hi, Renee. How are you? I don't have many people in here in this draw. No, they, they seem to have. Uh, First gone time, home. I'm, Renee. Hey, Renee, I'm about to pull out a, a name from our draw. If you share the live, I will put your name in here so that way you can be in this draw. <gasps> Letitia, how are you? Hello, Letitia. From Texas. Mm. Good morning, good morning. Okay. That? I'll just give everyone, I'll just give Renee and Atisha uh, a few seconds if they want to share the live and I'll, I'll um, add them into the draw. Yes. Oh, just shared. Renee said she just shared. Oh, yes. But it's, it's really annoying that the uh, comments are a bit poo. At the minute. Um, yeah, uh, I'm just, I don't, this is the first time this is happening. Because <laughs> uh, we haven't been on this week. So um, this is the first time we've been on and it's doing this. Mm. Thank you, Renee. I'm just going to put you in the, um, the draw. I can see it on the other page. Thank you very much. Um, so, Renee. <laughs> yes, everything is well, Letitia. I'm glad you're doing well. All right, I'm going to pull out a draw now. No. Has everyone shared that wants to share? Because I'm about to put... Oh, Angelica shared as well. Oh, just shared. <laughs> you're, you're mucking around with your comments, aren't you? You're, you're mucking around with your comments, Paul. Say that again, sorry? Are you mucking around with your comments? No. Angelique, I'm going to put your name in. I haven't seen you comment, but, oh, yes, I can see you now. Yes, we're good, Angelique. How are you? Thank you so much for sharing. I'm about to actually do a draw, pull, pull one, a name out, and, and I'm going to write yours in and include you and we'll go ahead with this. Angelique. Do uh, I'm doing that. fine, Angelique. Uh, and Dana, yeah. Um, no, I just, I'm just try, uh, try, changed it to a different page. I'm just wondering if it will work any different. Yeah, I've done that too. I've done all different ways. 
every single way you could think of, I have tried. If it works for you, tell me because, yeah, it's I will definitely do that. I will, I will throw, I'll, I'll throw something at the screen. Okay, because it is, yes, it is a nice name, Angelique De Luminaries. Am I saying that correctly, De Luminaries? So exciting. I know it is exciting, Renee. <laughs> Wow. Um, okay, so I'd love to charge my iPad. All right, here we go. Pardon? Is it cold where you are? Um, it is, but it's not as bad as it was the other night. Have uh, you got the heating on? No. That's right, you look a bit flushed. Because I'm in I I look innocent. <laughs> <laughs> mm, yeah, <laughs> I'm just wondering what you've been doing. No, I didn't know if you got the heating on or or whatever. No, no, no. I didn't realise I looked flush. I looked flush. Yeah. If any cars flush. come through your living room, the cars will stop. Okay, I'm gonna pull out a name. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? I'm, I'm hoping it's me. I'm hoping it's me. <gasps> Guess who it is? It's me. It is. I don't know how to put Miriam. Wanjiku. Wanjiku. I don't know how to say it. <laughs> Miriam. <laughs> it sounds like kuchi kuchi ku. <laughs> Wenji ku. <laughs> so, Miriam, are you still on, Miriam? Miriam. Miriam. And don't worry, guys, that we're pulling at, from the, the draw throughout the live. <gasps> She's there. Very good. Um, Miriam. Congratulations, you have won a free mini reading from both of us. Would you like to, um, oh, my goodness, I think I've worked it out. Uh, would you like to come on the live with us and we can see you and you can um, interact with us? Um, and to do that, you don't need to log into anywhere. Uh, all you need to do is send me your email address on Messenger to this page and I will send you an email invitation. And you just click on the link, make sure you enable the camera and audio when you're coming through and you'll you'll be straight here. So, yeah. Or you can do it through comments if you like. It's your choice. Oh, and I asked you your question, by the way. No, it doesn't work. It doesn't. I know. What a bummer. Yep. No, yeah. it, 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 it's just not working, is it? It's strange no. that, you know, um, we're having these problems, you know. Oh, well. bit weird, but I can't come on live. Can yeah, that's all right, Miriam. Um, that's okay. You can do it through the comments. That's fine. Yeah. Hello, um, Paige. How, hope hello, you're well. Paige. How are you? I hope you're well. And it's either sunny or cloudy or dark or whatever it is there. I hope you're enjoying the evening or morning or wherever you are. I can't remember. I know you've been on there before because I remember the name. Yeah. It's your birthday oh. today. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Paige. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so um oh. <laughs> Yeah. But but it, <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's good. But uh, oh, I'm all out of kilter because I come on 15 minutes late. Ugh. But it's not well done, Miriam. By the way, 
Well done. Yes, well yeah. done. I'm just uh, pulling out um, some cards for Miriam. Mm. No, but we'll, <laughs> we'll, do, we'll do the best that we can for you when we do a reading, when we do our mini readings. And, uh, yeah, we'll do our best. And uh, if, you know, want you to go away happier than you are at the moment. And uh, it's nice because Miriam, she's new, isn't she? Yes, uh, I haven't seen Miriam on here before. No, that's okay then. Um, no, it's nice that we, you know, we're getting all these wonderful new people, and um, they're supporting our our little group. And uh, you know, but if you've not been to the been here before, we don't know what um, you know what you think of it. You know, because we, like we say, we treat everybody the same. Um, we treat everybody the same. We don't treat anybody any different. Um, and we want people to come in and just relax and just enjoy. Yeah. No. Thank you, Miriam. Um, but that's your idea, you know. Um, yeah, that, that's what we want. We, we want you to come in happy and go away even happier. Yeah, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do our best. And what? What? Huh? Wait, what? I nearly yeah. dropped the whole deck. That's oh. all right, Michelle. We'll see you later. Oh, all right. We'll see you in a bit, Michelle. Um, but thank you for coming on for a, for the first bit, and then we'll see you on the second bit. <laughs> oh, thank you, Renee. Yeah, thank you. Well, that's the idea, isn't it? You know, we've got to have that calming. If, if we can give that um, calming um, across to all of you, um, it makes it better because it calms you lot down, but it also calms us down. <laughs> Paul Holmes, yes, I think so. I, that's probably why I took a closer look. <gasps> Where? Who? What? Can you see Paul Holmes's comment? Yeah, it says Paul was thinking she's making fun of me. Yeah, um, Angelique, we don't have a set time. Um, it's when we get tired, and um, because we, when you do readings, you you use your energy to you know connect and tap into the person you're doing the reading for. And um, Paul is a psychic medium. So sometimes, I, I, I mean, I can tell because I know him very well, but sometimes he's even channeling um, when he does a reading. So it, it, we, we stay on the live until we reach that point where we're really tired. Um, I myself, I'm in Melbourne, so it's night time here. Um, and Paul is in the UK. So it, it all, it's a many variants as to how long we stay on the live, isn't it, Paul? Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. <coughs> oh, yes. Um, but uh, no. Well, like I was saying a minute ago. <gasps> Hello, Andrea. How are you? Oh, did I say Andrea? Name? Andrea's yes. name? Yes, Andrea has just come on. Oh, righty-ho. Okay. Uh, are we all ready? Almost. <gasps> come on, you can do it. Almost. Eh? Mm. What's the matter, you, eh? Well, that was a good song in the 80s. Oh, yeah, so I know. Yeah. So uh, but do you know he wasn't Italian? Wasn't he? No. Gee, he sounded... Uh, yeah, he sounded... He sounded... Um, Italian? Yeah. His, well, his name's... And it, the way that he sang, he sounded Italian. <laughs> What? 
Oh, that's a man. I've got that song running through my head now. I can't get it. I can't get out. <laughs> can't get out in your head. Paige thought he was Italian too. Oh, well. We're, we're all disappointed, aren't we? I know he might be. And I was a boy just about to eat to greet. <laughs> oh, is free. Don't stay up late. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, oh, I'd so mad at you. Hey. God, and our respect. All right. You need to be quiet now, Paul. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Um, all right. Miriam. 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 Miriam, I've pulled out the card of peace for you. The card of peace. And um, the card of peace is it, it's something you're longing at the moment. Uh, there is, you know, um, conflicts at the moment and you are longing for peace. There are uh, conflicts um, in which the angels are actually opening up the hearts of the people involved so that they can resolve, so that they can have an understanding for everybody and the situation is resolved. But I need to tell you that not to worry because it will be resolved and to, to take comfort in that, that, you know, your angels around you and amongst all of you are uh, working on all of you to resolve this situation. Now, with yourself, uh, Miriam, I feel that you're a goal-driven person. Um, and when I say that, I mean you're quite competitive and when you set out to do something, you actually you do anything possible. You stress yourself out if you if you have to, if you must, and you do anything to reach it. And I, I want to let you know that you can actually do and achieve anything that you want, anything that your heart desires. And it, it's all a matter of uh, setting out the intentions. Um, because you're, you're such a passionate person, your intentions will make that manifest. But in order for it to be successful, um, you need to make things, let things happen on their own. Uh, don't focus too much on the results. Um, you know, I, I do feel like you're a real go-getter, um, as you've mentioned there, but, you know, um, holding on too tightly to um, having a desired outcome could actually sabotage it. So I, I need to guide you because there will be something coming up for you. And um, it's just a matter of um, simplifying your life and um, just going lightly on it. Um, don't carry too much of the burden on yourself to achieve these goals, let it happen because it will happen. So I hope that that helps you, uh, Miriam, and uh, that it resonated, but we'll see what Paul can get for you. Yes, let's see what we can get. And, uh, yeah, thank you for, like I said a minute ago, thank you, Miriam, for coming on to the show and supporting us. And, uh, yeah, see what we can see what we can get. <sighs> oh, excuse me. You want in the water? Hmm. Okay. All right. Okay. A lot of it. Um. What I'm going to tell you, you already know anyway. Okay, you've already got to that point where you. This is just more to give you validation and to give you some um, other new words to give you um, 
that peace of mind. Okay, um, you, you know, um, I think I'm yawning because I, I do believe that you're you're very tired and 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 you're doing too much. You need to start to relax and and rest because when you do too much, you start to fall away from your goals and everything because your mind just just doesn't work as well as it should. Okay. Um, well, basically, you've got to start to listen to what's going on around you. And you've got to make sure that when you listen, you take every little bit in because, you know, um, these what what's coming your way and other things that have gone on, you know, do by listening play a big you know will play a big part but uh you 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 like i said you you understand this already it's, it, and it's just it's just when um um i wonder what they'll say moments you know it feels like you go to i'm not it feels like you've been to some other people before and they've told you something so you're like I say, you, you know, you're you're hoping that we'll either say the same or, or something new. But that's me repeating it. But but from new things um, that are coming, you will you will learn and start to respect yourself again. And the learning is needed. Um, and <clears throat> like I said, if you if you don't learn from yourself then even the people that are around you um, are not going to, you know, they're not going to worry. But, um, you know, because it will look like you're just a normal normal person. But uh, if you start to learn from these things, they'll start to notice differences. <coughs> and the differences are what will start to move you and what will move you forward. OK, and those things that move you forward will take you forward into, you know, uh, something really amazing for yourself. But sometimes, or I would say most of the time, you're always looking to the past. OK, because you because there was a few problems that went on there, you're you brought it. You keep talking about it now. You know, that thing things from the past should stay in the past not unless it's something good you know if it's something good then you bring that forward if it's something that you just think oh i feel like i'm going around in circles and you know it's from the past why think about it why keep talking about it you know why talk about things that um you're not that you know are not going to help you okay so you've now got to you've got to um view everything that you do and uh, you know everybody and everything around you view it with with you know, open your eyes you've got to open your eyes to things because too much um it just feels like you close your eyes to everything a lot of the times and you think ah, i'll just sit back and watch and i'll just sit back and watch it you know but um i do believe that there's something either to do with an office it's either the job that you're doing or something that you want to set up okay like an office uh type area so that you can do it's like a, either a new business or start a, you know just go further like a promotion or something you know um but whatever you whatever you choose you know, you've got to make sure that it works for you because, you know, uh, when it comes to it and everything changes, uh, you will, uh, you'll notice it and everybody else will. OK, but I'm also seeing with you that there is spirit around you and there's, you know, because they do, they are close to you and, that, and they are, they are um, helping you. But like I said at the very start, it's like you're not ignoring them. It's like you just won't acknowledge them if, you know, because you're just, you know, um, you know you're not, you, you want to go further forward, but you've got to acknowledge all the 
um, all the changes, all the all the um, wonderfulness that you will that will support you. Okay, and just make sure that when when the spirit comes to you, if you know if you notice them, don't turn your head, don't turn your head away. You know because like I say, they they're putting a lot a lot of effort into in for this um, into this for you. You know, and you've got to put your effort in as well. But the um, yeah, you just got to keep going. You know, just don't give up because if you give up as well, you know, then you you've lost most of your life because this this has been in your life for a while. But don't don't give up. It's something that's special to a lot of people. And uh, yeah, but just don't give up. I'm going to leave that one with you, Miriam. And uh, I hope that resonated with yourself. And uh, have a great day, night, wherever you are. And thank you for being here. Thank you. Whew. Yeah. Good morning, Conda. How are you? Conda, I don't think I've seen you on here before. Lovely to see you on. Well, let's have a look. <coughs> um, yeah, good morning, Conda. Uh, Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I'm I'm reading the comment. No, that's all right. I'm just having a look to see if there's anyone else that's shared to put them in the draw, so we right. maybe we can pull someone else out. Yeah, we can put you know put them in the draw, and. Uh, <laughs> It'd be, get, it'd be getting noisy in the drawer now, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you for your comments there, uh, Miriam. Thank you. Um, and uh, welcome, Conda. Yes. Okay. Um all right, we'll, we'll see if we can pull out someone that would like to come on the live with us. Let me see. I hope they're still on. Okay, here we go. Let's see who's the next one going to be. Ooh. Who's the lucky one? All right. Who have we got here? Wow. <laughs> Is it Billy Bob? Is it Billy Bob? I was just putting up Renee's comment. Now, I don't know if he's still on, but I've got Paul Holmes. Are oh, you no. still on, Paul? Paul Holmes. Paul Holmes. Are you in? <laughs> Is Paul Holmes in the house? Are you in the house, Paul? Angela. Angela. Ange. She's Hello, Angelina. No, Angela. <laughs> Hello, Ange. Hope you're well. Grillo. What does Grillo mean? If you put pad after it, you get a Grillo pad. Okay. Yeah. I don't think Paul Holmes is on. Paul Holmes, calling Paul Holmes. <coughs> oh, right. no. Paul okay, Holmes. He would, have, he would have come on live. Yes, he would. Yeah. He definitely would. All right, so I'm going to pull out somebody else. <laughs> Okie dokie. All right, let's pull out someone else. 
Who will it be? Who's the lucky person? Whoever pull out, please come on. We want someone to come on live with us. Oh, he is. He's there. Hello. Pick someone else. That's all right. No worries, Paul. He's That's okay. Phone. I'm surprised you heard me. Giving up his spot. <laughs> Give up your spot. That's all right. Okay, so, all right, so we're picking out another person. <gasps> Who will it be? Who will it be? Renee's going, yay, come on, come on. <laughs> Michelle Miam, did she go already or is she still on? Um, I don't know. I have no idea. Are you still on, Michelle? I have a feeling she had to go, didn't she? Oh, yeah, yeah, she had to, didn't she, to pick a um, Sony Laura. Okay, so we're going to pick another one. If Simone was here, she'd go, next. All right, yeah, but, next person. Uh, but, I think, but I think Michelle might be coming back. So. Okay, I'll put her on the side here yep. and, um, and we'll see when she comes back. Okay, okay. Okay, who have we got next? <gasps> Haley, CC Haley, are you still on? CC Haley, are you in the house? CC Haley, are you in the house? <laughs> I don't think she is. <laughs> A few people have jumped. Off. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, it, it's, um, <laughs> it's a shame that all these people have jumped away because yeah. they're missing out on you know a lot of these um like free mini readings with myself and Silvana. Yeah. yeah, it's a shame. I think there's a few people um when they come on they want the reading to be immediate, but it just doesn't work that way. And no. so when we no. call out their name, they're not there. So, uh, but they, um, in saying that, you know, you can book a reading with us, uh, or or you can, you know, you can, uh, you know, uh, give a donation, and then uh, you'll be basically at the head of the queue. Um, uh, but uh, stand to yourself, you know. We don't force anybody to do anything. Yeah, that's right, Renee. You just have to wait. But, you know, yeah. we, we try and do as many as we can. That's why I do it in a drawer because when I used to do a list, uh, people were th they thought they would get a reading because they were on the list, but it would depend how tired I got. And a lot of times I didn't even make it down to the list, mm. uh, like all of it. So... Okay, who have we got here? Angelique, are you still on, Angelique? <laughs> so she's probably gone too. <laughs> yeah, they have left, Paige. I'm glad you're still on and Renee's still on. <laughs> At least we've got you two to talk to. <laughs> You know, uh, we'll have to start talking to ourselves. I don't think Angelique's on either. So <laughs> I'm going to pull out another one. Hang on. Let me just check if anyone else has shared, um, to, if I need to put any extras in the... Um... Uh, yeah, Dana's back. She's just had to put the kids to sleep. Oh, no, that's right. Yeah, Dana's in the drawer and <laughs> Angie's in the drawer. I've put you in, Angie. <laughs> yeah, don't go anywhere, 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 Renee, because I'm sure Renee's going to come out. There's not many left in here. 
<laughs> There's nobody left, so it's got to be one of you guys. <laughs> Who have we got? Wow. <laughs> Renee. <laughs> Renee. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were going to come out sooner or later. Um, <laughs> well, there's not many. Everyone's gone. I know. Everyone disappeared. Yeah. We don't know yeah. why. We, we're not that. Uh, it's because they want the reading straight away, but you just can't do everybody straight away. <laughs> no, it doesn't work like that. As no. you said, you know, we're here, you know, if, if um, as it says on the on the the title, we're here for some chat and also some readings. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. I'm glad you're still here. <laughs> yeah, we're here, um, we're here. You know, we're here to uh, give people a a bit of an insight on you know on things. But if there's no one here, you know. Yeah. You know what that means, don't you? We, we have to start singing. Oh, no, you don't want us to start singing. Actually, Paul's got a good voice. You don't want me to start singing. If I start singing, oh, there'll be no one left. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, you're right, Paige. It's, um, oh, I had it here. Oops, where she go? Just yeah. So. It's the whole fun of it, you know, the chat and everything. That is, that's what the, um, oh, my goodness. Come on, Paul, here we go. In the Navy. <laughs> or, as we used to say, in the gravy. Oh, is that a different version? Yeah, or you've got the rude version, in the ladies. In the ladies. Oh, I don't know. It's not that type of show, Paul. I know. <laughs> Now, Renee, you have a choice. Come on, would Renee. You, we'll yeah, would you like to come on the on the screen with us? Come on. Um, you don't need to have a login to do that. All you need to do is send your email address to this page on Messenger, and I'll send you an invite. You click on the link, and just as you're coming through, just make sure you click the. Um, mic and camera to enable them and um and that way we see you and you can talk to us uh so you'll have that interaction but i don't want to put any pressure on you we can still do it in the comments if that's what you prefer but a lot of people that have come on live um every time they come on that's all they want to do they want to go on the screen because they loved it yeah yeah, look, even Paige is saying, come on, Renee, go oh, live. Oh, come on, Renee. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dearie me. <laughs> Isn't it, eh? Come yeah. on. You don't need to put you don't need to take your curlers out. It, and a lot of people say they haven't done their hair or they have oh. <laughs> Uh, that's all right, Renee. You can actually even come. Oh, it doesn't accept just voice, does it? No. I don't know whether it accepts it. I didn't accept it with Paul Holmes. Yeah, as long as you've got your mic on, we can do. <laughs> Paige, Paige, Paige <laughs> do you know Renee? Do you? <laughs> Did you see what she put on there? Put I your teeth in, laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I can just imagine with in her rollers and everything. Put your teeth in, love. <laughs> no. oh, <okay. laughs> um, okay. Um. So no, that's all right, Renee. We can do it in the comments for you. <laughs> so I'm, I'm going to start pulling out some cards. <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> I'm drunk. <laughs> oh, okay. I thought maybe you knew it because of what you said. Put your teeth in. 
Oh, I'm not laughing at you, Renee. I just thought it was, you know, just funny in the comments. <laughs> well, she might have them in some Listerine or whatever it's called. Not Listerine. Oh, yeah. What's the stuff you put it next to your bed? Oh, yeah. It's definitely good to have a laugh. You know, if you don't have a laugh, you know. Yeah. Um, you know, you can't lift the energies, you know, and, it, and, it, and it's beautiful when when you can and um you know any laughter is a good thing it's a very good thing but a lot That's of people don't a lot of people don't think laughter is you know it, even if they're in a bad state you know and they get laughter would be fantastic you know um not not you know if if you've been in a negative energy <laughs> I'm a Gemini. I can't expect. <laughs> hey, if you're a Gemini, oh yeah, I was going to say that at your birthday soon, but it was today. I forgot. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not with it. I just realised. <laughs> Dirt. <laughs> is it, is it, it, I don't know. I don't. I've I don't got do my it. teeth in, but my brain's not in. Well, you don't come in on that, Paul. I, I thought I could hear some rattling. <laughs> and I see something slowly drop out your ear. <laughs> Did you see what Paige wrote? No, I'm not. Paige, I'm not drinking. I'm actually normally like this, and that's normal for me. <laughs> yeah, no, this is the normal Savannah. <laughs> um, she, she's, but it's what makes her who she is today we, we've all we've all got our own little traits as it were you know and savannah's got her uh you know laughter and and hairdo my hair what's wrong with my hair actually when emma came on she she no even paul holmes commented on my <laughs> hair he likes my hair <laughs> I, I just, um, it's okay, Paige, I'm, I'm pulling out her cards. Um, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, no, that, that's what I thought. I, I think she's got a big bottle of whiskey next to her. Nah, Paul, you know, I'll tell you something, Paul Holmes. There are people where I work that actually there's one person in particular that finds me irritating. <laughs> and um, this person is a very negative person and they can't handle people that um, laugh and sing and skip and, you know, that are happy. And so it's, it's just my personality. It's, uh, it's just the way that I am. So you can imagine if I did have a nip, I would be like maybe ten times worse. <laughs> I should not bring Elmo to work. No, I think I am Elmo at work. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't need to bring Elmo to work. Trust me. <laughs> okay, let me just. Um... <laughs> oh dear. They would hate me then, <laughs> says Paige. <laughs> oh, don't worry, Paige. Me and you together, we'll be right. <laughs> well, I've, I didn't ask, or I don't know if Sylvana did. Where, where are you from, anyway? Um, where are you from, oh, Runner? I didn't ask. No, I, I just wondered if you had. No, but, I didn't ask. Where are you both from? We know where Paul's from. Um. But, uh, you know, we didn't know where Rene or Paige comes from. We don't know if it's, we don't know if you're in the Australian outback or you're in the Americas or the UK. Oh, good. Everyone in the park can hear us. So, <laughs> so they can hear my voice. That's, that's <laughs> nice. Hello. <laughs> Oh, Paul, Paul uh, Holmes has just turned off. 
<laughs> Only South Wales. <laughs> Bolton Point. Where's Bolton Point? Uh, on the Lake Muscuri, New South Wales. I don't. I don't come from Australia, so I have no He's idea. Not Australian. No. He's <laughs> from the UK. Yes. <laughs> He's he's British. <laughs> and so you have been on the source, haven't you? <laughs> I, haven't, I swear. <laughs> I swear. It's just the way I am. I know, I, I know. I know. <laughs> Who's posh? Me. Why me? Yes, Paul. Paul. The uh, my Paul. He's yes. He's very very posh. And um, he keeps reminding me that he's British. <laughs> North Coast, is that North Coast like USA, North Coast? <laughs> yes, I'll have a cupola, but <laughs> I'll have a cupola. <laughs> is that a new drink? <laughs> well, I know, I know that it's your spelling. I was just teasing you. A cupola tea. Yeah, it's a new flavour. It's it's the herbal tea. It's the herbal with cola. Yes. Paige and I will be drinking the herbal tea cupola. Yeah, but don't forget to lift your little pinky. There we go. We'll be just... Oh, okay. Oh. Are we all ready? Yes. <laughs> that, that sounds better, Paige. I'm a good copper. <laughs> right, you ready there? Yes. Right, yeah, go for it. North of Central Coast. North of Central Coast where? I don't know. Do you know where that is? What's north of Central Coast? Um, what country? <laughs> what country is that? Australia. <laughs> Oh, of Australia? Yeah, they both come from Australia. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry. So, Renee is north of Central Coast. So, what? <laughs> you're in Northern Territory. Uh -huh. can, you, can you read New that? New South Wales. Okay. Yeah. North yeah. of Central Coast. And, I got you. Okay. and you're saying that somebody's been watching us. Now they're coming... You know, been hearing us, and now they're coming. Hello, to lady. Hello, lady. Hello, <laughs> lady. Come on Facebook and watch. We'll give you a reading. Yes. All right. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> lady. <laughs> Hello, everyone in Hall Park. <laughs> okay. I don't know where you're sitting, Ange, but if you're sitting down where the, the path is, the normal path, where and you're looking out to the trees, wow. People can definitely hear us because it echoes around there. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, I'm about to do... Wow, Dana. Thank you. Yeah, I know everyone's been really good with the shares. It's fantastic. All right, I'm about to do Renee's reading. <clears throat> okay, Renee, I've pulled out this card here and this is like focus on service. This is all about, see the lady on the white horse at unicorn and um, with the angel wings. This is all about um, you being everybody's white knight basically you coming to everybody like it's Renee to the rescue you know you are everybody's um savior you know you save them um and you're always helping everyone you do you bend over backwards to help people uh, it's just the type of person that you are it, it's um it's like you know is there any more anything more that I can do for you 
It's just who you are. You're always, you're very invaluable and you help so many people. And, um, but, you know, it, it, and, and and I feel that it's this type of work, what you do to help people, it has, it actually, um, it's like a word of mouth goes around and um, people are recognise you, uh, recognising, oh, Renee, yes, Renee's a lifesaver. And, and people recognise that um, a word gets around, oh, so-and-so's friend Renee helped her do this and that and she was there for her, you know, she really helped her, she was a shoulder to lean on, um, she really helped this person out and um, you'll find that because of this trait that you have um, that there's going to be an opportunity coming for you. Um, there's going to be uh, like something really important. There's going to be really important doors opening for you. And um, when that happens, don't be afraid. Um, it, it will be things that you haven't tried before. Um, it will feel um, kind of like an unknown territory, but it's what you're meant to be doing. It's the pathway that you need to go because you're a very wise woman, Renee. Um, you're very wise and you're also like um, a wise messenger. You're a very wise person and people also lean on you to, to talk out their problems and you always seem to have the answers for people. Now, um, I feel that you don't have to do anything. These opportunities that are happening are going to be coming right to you. So um, just focus on what you're doing. You're doing fantastic and your light is actually shining. And this is why it's like what we put out, we receive back and you're actually going to be receiving back now everything that you've done for everybody. Um, you're actually... You're going to be, um, you're actually very independent and very strong person and um, it, it's it's something that, um, which is fantastic with all these opportunities that will be coming through. But just don't worry when they do come through. Um, it's the way that it should be. It's the, your pathway that you need to go through. So just go through, take step by step and listen to your um, intuition as you move through this because um, that, you know, that you, your very, um, your intuition is spot on. So, um, you know, that, that's all I can really get for you, Renee. So I hope that this helps you. Um, Paul is going to see what he can get for you and uh, I'd love to know in the comments if that resonated. Hmm. Right, let's see what we can get for you, Renee. And uh, yeah, thank you for being here and yeah, having a good laugh <laughs> and enjoying the camaraderie. Thank you. Oh, oh, in a way. God. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. What I'm getting with yourself, uh, Rene, is it feels like you've got a bit of um, anxiety, okay, inside, and it's something that uh, you've been trying to get rid of for a very long time. And when it happened, when it first happened, you, you know, you didn't think it had happened to you. Okay, but you know, it just did, and now it's time to try and get get you back to the old self. Um, but you, you know, you've you've got so much, uh, so much inside you. It's like your, it's like there's two sides to you. It's like you've got the inner you and the outer you it's like you want to bring the inner you out again because your your um 
focus you've just lost that focus it's just like the focus that you have in life has just disappeared okay and it feels like there, there is a group of people that that do rely on you okay um and they rely on you because you've got all that wonderful energy that you have but because you're up and down up and down you know when when you talk to them it's like they can you know feel the energy so it might affect them as well as well so you've got to get yourself into a really good place and make sure that when when you uh you know uh when you do move start to move you know towards finding the goal uh the 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 door to move you forward you know you've got to make sure that you know you uh give yourself a chance okay because you are um the heartbeat of many things in people's lives and not not just the ones that i just mentioned you know they're there because they need you and then and they need your um guidance they need your love they need that um that uh that <laughs> yeah that, that guidance which will give you that progression and it will move you forward into something more uh, more of you it'll give you know it's like like i said the, you know you've you've got you've got to find yourself again you've got to make sure that when you find yourself everything will be it has to be in the right order you know because it's like your head's all over the place and the boxes that um of the challenges that you're going to be doing are all over the place you know and you're just i've said this to a, a few people it's like you're just grabbing at anything just you know it's like grab the shortest straw or the longest straw uh game but you've got to make sure that you you do um take it on on the chin because it is your life you know and you will find that um that uh when when uh oh, i can't even think what i'm going to say now yeah it just feels like there's a it feels like you that's how you feel a lot of the time it's just like you just don't know what to say it feels like you just do not know what to say anymore it feels like i can't i don't know what to do i don't yeah it just feels like i don't know what to do i know what the situation is but i just don't know what to do you know um but one minute you're okay and then you're not you know but you've got to make sure that you you don't um let yourself down because this it feels like there's some money that want that's either coming to you or a new position that's going to give you that money to to take you to the next stage but it's not all about the money it's you you might need it to pay the bills and stuff but it doesn't always work like that you know sometimes it's um you know you're you're just worrying what will i do if i give up something okay okay it's, it's like um what was it it's it's like the position in work or something like that um okay if you leave you know you're worried about where the funds are going to come from okay but don't worry about that like i said the funding will be there but it's not all about the money it's about how you treat you know and how quick you can find something new okay but uh there's also something that you've got to send that this will help you i'm assuming to help you you've got to send this thing to help you to bring that new venture forward okay and if you, you but it's very very important to do this okay if you don't if you don't do it 
uh, then you'll be waiting even longer. Okay, but you 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 know you can do all of this. You you can do it, and you you'll you'll enjoy it. Okay, whatever comes, you've got to make sure that you enjoy it and get out there with the laughter and make sure that you you know as many people as possible. Okay, and uh, yeah, just just yeah, you can do it. You you can do it. You've got that fantasticness in your head, but you've just got to make sure that you focus and get there okay i'm going to leave that one with you and uh yeah thank you renee and thank you so much renee thank you <gasps> yes donna please do that please do we want someone to come on with us Just sneak away quietly, quietly. <laughs> I'd just like to say thank you to Dana. Dana has actually just donated and um we're going to do a reading for her oh hey my sister from another mister is on <laughs> sarah sarah martin in the house how are you sarah um yeah that's okay do it do the walk slowly don't um and you're most welcome renee so uh, i think dana's going to be coming on the live with us and uh, we'll be doing the reading for her on the live. Um, if she makes it out quietly, not to wake up her son. <laughs> um, Dana, while you're walking away quietly, if you would like to send me your email address on Messenger to this page, and I will send you the invite, I will email it to you so you can click on the link to join us. Make sure you've got us somewhere um, where they won't hear us because I'm quite loud. <laughs> That's good, Sarah. I'm glad you're all good. So you you you're quite loud, are you? Um, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think I just got the message. Let me go there. Oh, look, Dana. <laughs> Here we go. I'm just going to copy. Um, oh, I can't wait to meet Dana. It's her birthday. Uh, no, that's Paige's birthday. Yeah. You'll have to. You should come on too, Paige. Um, let me see. Invite. Yeah. Thank you, Renee, for your comments. Thank you. Um, Oh, that's oh, that's nice. Hello, Sarah. How are you, Sarah? <laughs> Sarah goes loud. You never. <laughs> uh, uh, look. Yeah, look, but look, Tisha says it's cold. I <laughs> know. Oh, would you oh, believe hey, it's in bed too? Come on, aren't you in Australia? Isn't it um, early? It's 9.35, girl. <laughs> and it's your birthday. Why are you in um, bed so early on your birthday? Most probably have to get up in the morning. Um, yes, as of <laughs> tomorrow, Tisha. <coughs> and, um, Paul, how did you go with your plumping? My what? My... <laughs> your plumping. <laughs> Oh, Paul, Paul, I knew there were, I was wondering why you were smiling. You were smiling too much, Paul. So now we know why, plumping. My plumping. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now we all 
will do a bit of plumping now and then. So. <laughs> Um, <laughs> Paige, Paige would like to put on her bra and some teeth in. <laughs> yes, good idea, good idea. <laughs> yes, um, might be good. <laughs> okay, so um, you get a different clientele. <laughs> yes, we would, wouldn't we? Dana, just if you can hear me, I sent that email off to you. And um, oh. now I don't know why you were telling someone else to put their teeth in. <laughs> now I get it. <laughs> it's, a shame, it's a shame that on Facebook itself the comments are not working. I know. I've been using my iPad. Um just so that I can put love hearts and things. It's snowing in Blue Mountains. Are you near the Blue Mountains, Tisha? Oh, Tisha, has your nan come home from hospital? Is she at home now? And how's um, Shania going? Has she had the baby yet? Oh, yeah. It's any day now. And she had the no, little one. So what, are you going to go skiing on the Blue Mountains or near there? Here it's, uh -huh. um, yeah. Yeah, because. Um, oh, Dana yeah. said almost ready. Oh, <laughs> she's seeing um, Paige. She's probably putting her teeth in. So she was listening to you <laughs> and her bra. <laughs> She's probably Don't forget to put the top and the bottom in of your teeth. <laughs> oh, she's still there. Next week. <gasps> They're going to do something to bring the baby out. Okay, oh, no. induce it. Wow. They're going to show. They're going to show you laughing. <laughs> Do you think showing me laughing to Shania is going to make her go into labour? Oh, that's nice. <laughs> I think so. Oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. She's 38 <laughs> weeks next week. Oh, so it's still – I was two weeks late when I had my son. So sometimes even if they haven't worked it out properly, um, you know, The baby would stay in Paul there. Holmes, you are so naughty. Look what Paul said. No, the baby would stay in if that saw my face. <laughs> you know what? I think it would. I, I think I would be so loud that I would just scare the baby to go back in. It wouldn't come out. Yeah, I'd be saying, let me back in. Let yeah, back in. <laughs> definitely. Oh, my God, what is wrong with this world? Let me back in. I don't want to be out here. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. But, but, yeah. But uh, when you see your nan, say hello from us. Yes, yeah, say hello from us. Yeah. And give and her a big know. hug and a kiss from us as well. Yeah, yeah, definitely. We're just waiting for Donna, Donna. Do, 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 do. All right, elevator music while we're waiting for Dana. It'll be a long elevator, right? Dana. 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 Yeah, she'll be out soon. You know, she's just got to be ready. Yeah. She's not ready for that marathon yet. <laughs> I should say, yeah, the first thing you see is the one. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. You can do it on your um on your phone, Dana. You don't have to use a laptop. It's probably better on a laptop. Um, but you can do it on your phone. So just go to your emails where I sent the email to you. Oh, it won't work on your phone. Oh. Oh, that's strange. 
Okay. Okay. Yeah, give it another go. Um, and when when you when you click on the link, it should um, it'll give you like a window will come up, and um, you make sure you select the mic and the camera to be on so we can yeah. hear you. But uh, close your Facebook. Close yeah. your Facebook, otherwise we'll get feedback and then I'll have to mute you. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. No, because it comes up with um, allow or uh, allow mic and Mal oh, I can't say it, Malcolm. Uh, allow mic and uh, uh -huh. a mic and camera. <laughs> I couldn't resist it, Sarah. Okay, yeah, close Facebook. Try now. Yep. Yeah, I've just realised Sarah's got a new photo. Yeah, I was looking. I was trying to work out. Have you, because I know she was putting red, but it looks like purple. Doesn't it look like a purpley, pinkish purple or something? <laughs> yeah. What, what colour is your hair, Sarah, now? What colour is it? Because I, I remember she was the sexy red hair, hot lips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah look, I don't know. That looks like, um, I don't know. I think she's trying every colour. More purple now. More purple? Yeah, because it looks purple or pinkish purple in the photo. <laughs> pinkish okay. purple. So what do you do? Do you just put rinses through? She's, eventually she's going to get a blue rinse. <gasps> Isn't it funny, though, like now it, it's so the rage to have blue hair and green hair and purple and pink hair and everything. But many, many years ago, as um, the senior ladies became uh -huh. older and their hair was white, they would get those blue rinses, pink rinses, and that put through their hair, and you think, oh, that's old, right? And now here we're doing it. We're colouring our hair pink, purple, blue, green. Right. Uh, your friend's a hairdresser. Do you know, Sarah, we have a hairdresser in the house at the moment. Are you still on, Tisha? Tisha's a hairdresser too. Mm. <gasps> you're kidding. You're opening your packages. Wow. Oh, yeah. what, what what arrived this morning, Sarah? She can't say it was from a certain place. <laughs> is it is it um, adults only? Or <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, Sarah was saying a minute ago. It's uh, it's beautiful sunshine where she is. We're getting dark clouds. It looks like it's Are gonna. You? Oh, crystals in a purse. Oh, I want to see. I want to see. I want to see. Crystals in a purse. Yeah. What kind of purse is it? Is it one of them pink ones with the pink things they, like kitties used to have? Here we go. Here we <laughs> go. Yes. Done um, is on. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> yeah, I know. And you didn't wake your, your son up, did you? No, he's still asleep. Oh, that's good. <laughs> so oh, how it's are you? so nice to have you on, Dana. It actually worked when I closed Facebook. That was the problem. Yeah, it's because your phone, it's using that that um audio and everything so it won't let you probably go through because this uses camera and audio so yeah so you're in australia right yeah in surface paradise oh nice have you got nice weather at the moment it's freezing <laughs> it's oh. really cold even during the day you can't go out like it's too cold what, what um, sort of temperature are you looking at 20 I think the coldest overnight was like it got up to like three degrees down. Oh, I mean, that's not cold. Yeah, it is for us though. <laughs> you wait until you get minus tens and twelves and fifteens. Yeah. Everybody's saying hello to you, Dana. Sarah's saying oh, hi, Dana. Paige is saying hi, Dana. 
and yep. um, Paul Holmes is rambling on about women and purses. I don't know why. <laughs> I think that's what Sarah was saying. Okay. <laughs> that's and um, Paige said, hey, Dana, you're, you're not far from Paige. Oh, oh, I can see the comments now, but I can't have oh, them up at the same time. Yeah, that's all right. What I'll do is if there's anyone that puts a comment that's to you, I'll put it on the screen after the after the reading. Okay. Yeah. So um, the way this works, Dana, and for, um, firstly, thank you so much for the donation. That's um, okay. The way this works is that I will pull out some cards for you and do your reading, and then and don't say anything while I do the reading for you. And then yeah. when I finish, don't still don't say anything, right? And Paul will do the reading for you. And then when Paul finishes, you can give us your feedback. Okay. Okay. All right. So I'm going to start pulling out some cards for you. Well, I'm, I'm going to sit here and, and just watch the screen. Now, um, what I'm going to do is ask the question that I normally ask people that have never been here before. Yeah. How far is it to the moon? No, um, <laughs> no, um, no, um, <laughs> what, what do you think of um, how we work the show? I like it, <clears throat> it's so good. That's why I always jump on when you guys are on. Mm. No, no, we appreciate that. No, because mm -hmm. um, I might repeat myself a few thousand times during the show, but I, I appreciate each and every one of you because you lift the energies and you know, you all talk to each other. And we all talk to you, and we don't, we don't miss no one out. But yeah. uh, you know, <clears throat> that's the idea of our show. Um, when we first started, we didn't think it, you know, turn into something like this. We thought it was just going to be loads of readings, and yeah. But we thought, well, no, we've got to have a chat here and there, and I'll have some laughter as well. So, mm. you know, but that. What yeah. do you think of that? You know, because. Because we're talking, you know, we chat as well and not just do reading. Yeah, it's so good. I love watching your guys live. Like, I join in on the conversation too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, it's good. I like it when everyone, like, uh, interacts and they talk to one another on there as well. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Because I, I don't know what part of the, was it New South Wales, did you say you came from? Um, surface, I'm in Surface Paradise now. But I used to live in Coomera, which is like 20, uh, it's half an, hour, half an hour away. And I was born in New Zealand. Oh, my goodness. Well, I, I, you know, I, was, I was getting New Zealand in my head for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> I, and I moved to Australia when I was like eight years old. Wow. Mm. Yeah. Uh, so do uh, you remember like living in New Zealand? And not really. No. No, oh, a little bit. It's like a have little bit gone, of like, yeah. yeah. Have you gone there since? I've only been once. It's beautiful there. I've yeah. never actually been there myself. <laughs> well, I um, know about it as much as you guys do. <laughs> so that again, sorry. I know about as much as you guys do because I've only been there once. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I've never been there. I've never been to Australia. Australia. Australia is the best. Oh, you haven't been here. Have you been to the <laughs> UK? No. Oh, you're... I don't think she's been to the UK. No. Have you been to no. the UK, Donna? I haven't. The only other place I've been to is Bali. <gasps> so have I. <laughs> <laughs> when was your recent time? Like, when was the last time you went there? I went I went a few years ago. It was like I can't even remember. It was like my son was one for so four years ago. Okay. Yeah. So you didn't get barley belly, did you? No, I didn't. <laughs> but I got oh, homesick. You got and homesick. Five, yeah, and I only went for five days. You got homesick. Yeah, because I left my oh. kids at home. Uh, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that's understandable. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's like me when I've been to Florida or or, or other places, you know, to the states. You know, 
you just think, right, I'm going on holiday. I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Some somebody will be looking after them. You know, you've just got yeah. to enjoy yourself. Yeah. Oh. I did enjoy myself though. But I missed my kids and I felt homesick from my whole family. Wow. Wow. But that's strange that uh, you get homesick for five I know some people do. Well, I've but... never been anywhere. I looked, That was my first holiday anywhere by myself. Wow. Yeah. Wow. I think um, I went to a place called Ibiza. Um, oh, yeah. Have you heard of Ibiza? Yeah, I've heard of it. Yeah. I went there twice in one year. That's how good it was. Wow. Yeah. yeah. But because it's only, what, a three-hour, four-hour flight from here? Yeah. Oh, My cool. arms hurt after, though. <laughs> Party? Flappy. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, dear. No, it's good, though. That, but you're, you've got, I don't know what, um, in location to yourself, is it Bali's the closest one? Is it New Zealand and yeah. New Zealand's the closest? Yeah, and then Bali's six hours away. Think, up, yeah, what other places are close to you that you could go on holiday? Mm, those are the only two I know. <laughs> wow, so you aren't you only had a couple of choices? Yeah, like, um, there's probably other places, but I've never been there. Mm. Yeah, yeah, probably, yeah, six hours is probably as long as I'd want to fly it too. <laughs> wow. No, um, I think mine's about 11 hours. Yeah. yeah. Six hours was long enough. <laughs> yeah, because you do get bored after a while. Yeah, especially with no TV. <laughs> no, no TV? <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I've actually I've got um, Dana's cards ready. Oh, okay. 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 Right. Um, Dana, um, while we've been talking to you, um, I feel within myself um, a, a heaviness, like um, I need to, like, breathe in and out. <sighs> I, I, um, and, like, there's an unbalance, an unbalance in your energy throughout and um, I, I feel that there's an an, an unbalance in um, in what you do, uh, what you do. You give out a lot, but there's not much done for you. And um, there could be also like um, a bit of um, stress that you feel on top of you, and that's why I'm getting that feeling to like breathing. I want to breathe in and out just to relax and balance myself. Um, I'm getting um, a strong sense of you needing to be in silence, um, having quiet time uh, in meditation and, um, you know, and, and just contemplating about things. And I, I really feel that this is what you need so that you can just let go um, of everything that's happening all around you um, because, you know, silence does heal and it replenishes you. Um, meditation, if you haven't done this before, uh, even just small spurts like 15 minutes where um, guided meditation is quite good. There are um, things you can search on eBay, uh, not eBay. I don't know why I've got that in my mm -hmm. head. Sarah Martin mm -hmm. with her shopping. Yes. Um, I met YouTube. Uh, you can actually get quite good um, guided meditations on there. And if you um, if you want, if uh, I can send you later a link. There's one that I listen to that's quite good. They've got a whole heap of them. Now, um I, I feel with yourself, you do need that time to yourself yeah. to have that silence and also even if you don't want to meditate, just to have that soothing um, music. But um, I, I do feel that you have um, in this time that you're going through now, um, you've been thinking about, you've been having nostalgia about the good old days. 
Um, that's what I'm getting. It's like, oh, those were the good old days. I wish that, you know, I could be like that again. Um, I pulled out this card here, just reminiscing about things you used to do before. Um, so I'm getting this. But I, I find that if you um, are able to do some meditation, you'll find that your pathway and what is before you will become clearer. I do feel that you are going to have um, a door opening to you um, for something that um, you would like to do, but in the form of an artistic, creative way. And when I say artistic, it could be maybe in the form like of painting. It could be something to do with music. Um, it's something that um, I feel that is... Like it's an outlet for you, but also it's going to be an opportunity that's going to come to you to be able to use that side of yourself. Um, but <clears throat> I feel that you do need to start taking this time out for yourself, to which will assist, which will um, open the door for these um, opportunity to come to you. Um, that's all I can get for you at the moment, Dana, but we'll don't say anything yet and we'll see what Paul says can see for you. Okay. Okay, let's see what we can get for you then, Dana. And, uh, yeah. Oh, let's focus on you. Okay, no idea. Okay, right. What I'm getting with you at the moment is it just feels like you're the place that you are at the moment isn't the place you want to be, but the place. The place that you of that you've given a lot of time to, okay, is not not happening for you. I know I'm just repeating myself, but it just seems like that's what you seem to be doing for yourself. It's like repeat, 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 and it feels like all you keep doing is repeating um, these challenges that are going to move you forward. Okay, you you if you if you've got ideas in your head, right? You're you're going for these ideas, and then you just think, right? I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll do that, and then you'll just suddenly walk away from the ideas and hope to God that they work, <laughs> basically. <laughs> and and the majority of these what you're wanting are not going to happen instantly which a lot of people think is going to happen when you've got an idea you know that idea you can put it down on paper you can put it into a book you know so that it's out of your mind but you'll you'll, you'll still see it but wherever it takes you it's going to be somewhere better than you are now okay you've got to keep in touch with yourself but you've also got to keep in touch with these um these new ventures okay those ventures will bring uh you forward and mm -hmm. and help you to guide you into something uh that is new which is more i feel that it's going to be more spiritual to be honest yeah and it's going to help you to become, or oh, it's going to help you to open yourself up, okay? Because there's there's a, there's a few uh, spirit around me. It's like this: there's someone that always stands beside you. There's always someone that stands close to you, and I do believe it that you can actually feel them. Uh, and when they're stood there, you they can actually 
you know, they, it feels like there's somebody that actually does come from the spirit world and they do touch you, as in um, give you um, that. They, they're trying to give you a kick up the bum, basically. Well, that's what they're trying to do. They're, they're always there and they're trying to give you that that wording. If you're, <laughs> if you're um, seeing words in your mind, these, these are the messages, you know, that they're trying to they're trying to give you it feels like there's a, a it feels like there's a lady that that has come through before and she's trying and she comes through every single time if you because it feels like you've done this again um i said this to somebody earlier it's like you've done this before and you've gone to re uh, readers or mediums psychic mediums before and you're it's like you just want to know the words and what them words mean. Okay, you, you just want confirmation. Okay, but you gotta look after yourself and let the let all the negative flow away and bring all the good stuff in. Okay, but what I'm getting with yourself also, I don't know what this is all about. It's something to do with a bank. I don't know if it's something to do with it. Um, the money side or a new job or, you know, a loan or something so that you can uh, move something forward. It's like, a, like I said earlier, a new venture or just something that, that's going to help you, okay? But something to do with a bank. I, I'm, I'm not going to go into that one because that's a bit more private. But, uh, but also you do need to get out and focus your mind more and calm down. Yeah, just get out into nature. I know this this is just gone off the cuff, but you need to get out into nature to calm yourself down after this thing that's happened with um, yeah. what, what I feel with the bank and everything. But you know, but you do need to get out there and just enjoy life again because it feels like you, it feels like you're letting yourself down too much. You know, and you can't keep doing that. It feels like, yeah, I'll, I'll, you know, you see the problem and you think, I can, you know, it feels like you want to change it, but you just can't at this moment in time because you're not not focusing enough on, on you and the other people around you. If you focus on you as well, uh, on everybody, sorry, that's around you, you will... I understand uh, that um, the guidance from <laughs> the spirit world and this, it feels like this lady, okay, that everything will just fall into place. But you you are also a thinker. You are mm -hmm. also a thinker. And this is why, yeah, I'm, I'm going to say this, but you overthink things. <laughs> overthink things and you don't listen, Okay. And you don't take the time to listen, okay? Too many people in this world just think everything's going to fall in their plate or fall on the plate for them, you know. And it doesn't, you know. If you're if you're thinking about something, make sure they're positive thoughts, you know. And when you're going to listen to people, make sure that you're listening to. I said this to someone earlier as well. Make some. Uh, make sure you're listening to everything else. That um, around you, not just those people, because everything is like a jigsaw puzzle. And once that jigsaw puzzle 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 falls into place, you know you will find that life will be easier. But to me, this is a second chance. Okay, it's it's like a second chance that you've been given to give yourself um, something good in life. Okay. And it's like, I think what I've been talking about before is the, you know, the first chance. And now it's time to take that second chance and make it work for you. Okay. Because if you don't, you'll just, you'll just be sitting in that one place. Um, you've got to also start relaxing because relaxation is good for you. I think Silvana mentioned about the meditation and I've already mentioned about getting out into nature and watching the birds and getting out and looking at the trees, tree hugging, if you have to. 
you know, just <laughs> you're there. But also, um, I can't know what this is about at the moment, but there's a light that shines around you, okay? There's a light that shines around you, and it's, to me, it's either your, the light, the light bulbs just come on, or for, for a great idea, or you're just an earth angel that, that hasn't awoken yet, okay? And you're, you're picking up on energies and, and things like that, but you just don't know how to deal with it. And you, you, you are a special lady to a lot of people, and you can do a lot of these things that, you're, that you want to do. You know, it's just how you move it forward and how, what direction you want to take them. Okay. But uh, I'm going to leave that one with you. And I hope that resonated with yourself. Um, yeah. Yeah. So thank you. <clears throat> now it's your turn. <laughs> wow. That was so much to, <laughs> that was so much to hear. I'm just trying to process it. Well, I'm going to talk about Paul's because he was just then and I remember most. But um, when you said um, someone stands behind me, I feel like that's my um, nanny Edith. She, I felt her today when I was um, talking to someone. I met someone randomly today and he was 78 years old and he was a twin because I'm a twin as well. So I was like, what a coincidence. Mm -hmm. And then he started telling me that he was a Reiki master. And I was just like, wow. Okay, so I got his number and now I'm going to his house like at the end of this month for a Reiki healing, a reading. And, well, mainly I want it for the reading, but they said it comes with, um, no, I wanted it for the Reiki, but it comes with a drawing of your spirit guides as well as a reading. And, like, I don't know, this guy that I met today, when you were talking about the spiritual, I think you're going to do something spiritual and creative. But that's yeah. what I thought of at that time. Okay. But, and it was just crazy how I, it was just this random guy. He was sitting next to me and he says, tell me your date of birth. And he wrote it down. And he goes, he like came up with the number six and he was like, all right, you're halfway there. <laughs> and I, I just thought it was so random. And he was, an, he was just a person just like... I didn't even know what he was doing there. He got up and left after I spoke to him, which, which I thought was even stranger. So mm. I feel like that has a lot to do with part of your reading. <laughs> and um, uh, oh. if you yeah. can't remember it, you can watch it back later. Yeah, I can remember it. I'm just trying to like process it. <laughs> yeah, how can I say what I? Yeah. <laughs> Um, when you were talking about um, meditation, I literally have been meditating like every day because I've been looking for a house. Um, I left my family situation because of just yeah. not getting along with them. And this definitely is my second chance at trying to find a house without my family because I need to do it on my own because I just want to cut toxic ties to my family just to be my own person. And we're actually in, like, the best place we've ever been today. We found somewhere and we've got at least, like, we're comfortably living for a little bit. And, yeah, it's <laughs> I can finally relax today. But, yeah, that would wow. come back. And I was definitely, I was going to have, because there's a spa bath here, and I was going to have a spa and meditate after this. Wow. Okay. Yeah. My sister already no. sent me, like, because um, my sister, she's, like, a psychic as well. I don't know what type specifically, but she is a reader as well. And she sends me all these YouTube links, and she's like, do this. And I have, like, friends who are always, like, mm. um, light some candles, have a bath, and then just relax. So I, I do plan on doing all that. And I am an overthinker, so I'll be more mindful of that mm. <laughs> listening because I feel like, um, another one of my spirit guides, I don't know, I feel I have two, but I know my nanny, Edith, she always touches my back, which she did when I met the Reiki master today. She always does, like, in random moments. Like, she doesn't all the time, but I always feel her on my back, 
on my left side, like over my shoulder, like how you said. Mm -hmm. She was there today when I met the Reiki master, so I figured like that was supposed to be and She's like, this is a good idea, do it. <laughs> and then today I heard, like, I'm not sure if it is true, but I feel like my auntie, she tries to come through and I hear it in my right ear. I can hear something. I've only just started hearing it, like, for a little bit and I just like, what is that? What are you trying to say? I heard that, like, maybe a few hours ago. So, yeah. Strange, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> yeah, because like, I stop, like, when I can hear something in my ear, I stop and I'm like, what is that? And then I'm like, I try to, like, <laughs> listen to what, if I get anything in, like, words or, like, messages or anything. And, yeah, I, I don't get anything but, like, the ringing or the noise in my ear. Mm. Um, wow. But that, that's yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah, but and, like, the last thing that you said about like an earth angel, like I've looked up earth angels before as well and maybe I am one and I definitely haven't awoken, but I know like I've been told about like that I have like gifts in me, but I just am like clueless to them. <laughs> no, but when, once you're open, you'll find the doors will just, you know, yeah. at the moment they just slowly, you know, you're there and they want to open. But it's like you get there and they close. Yeah. Because it's, you want you want to, but you just don't want to see what's beyond it. Yeah. Yeah. Like what my sister says, like even like when I have a headache, my sister, she's just like, it's probably your crown chakra trying to open it and you're stopping it. <laughs> That's like this, the stuff she says to me. Yeah. Yeah. But you just got to let it, if, you, if you're comfortable with it, then just let it flow. Yeah, I don't know how to though. <laughs> Just open, uh, med uh, well, meditation or, or talk yeah. to your sister. Talk to your sister. Yeah. She'll she'll help you. Or this Reiki master. Yeah, yeah. the she'll Reiki master. Help, help you. It'll definitely. I'm help doing you. that on the 27th of this month. Hmm. Oh. And, he, and he actually called me already afterwards, like because I was like, I definitely want to do it. And he was just like, Yes, maybe we should meet beforehand, and I'll give you Reiki. <laughs> I was like, yes, please. I need a lot. Yeah, a lot yeah. of people. A lot of people do at this moment in time, you know, because they, you know it's uh, it's a hard life at the moment for everybody. Yeah. It yeah. is. Yeah, I've done not... so much in the last three days that it's crazy. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's why I've been stressing. I've done so 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 much looking and good stuff though. Yeah, never stress. <laughs> Never, Never stress. There's always an op there's always another way. Yeah, yeah. I I say that to everyone else, but I can't help stressing myself. <laughs> there you go. It's, sometimes it's like we we can give the answers out, but you won't use what you have to help yourself, like you say. Yeah. 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 <laughs> we got a question from Chichi. Chichi. <laughs> Let the spirits let you know when you're awake. Um, it depends. It depends. It's a good question. My, yeah. I don't know all the answers, but when are you open? You yeah, definitely you can sense like minded people. Yeah, of course you do. Um, I met someone today. Um, I'd never met this person at all. And within five, well, five seconds, it's like I'd known them all my life and that's how quick you know you can connect with somebody who's similar to yourself yeah. I'm, assuming, I'm assuming you connect with a lot of people and yeah. you, you can walk anywhere and somebody will go yeah hello <laughs> are, you, are you talking to me yeah yeah, <laughs> <Somebody>. <laughs> yeah i make friends everywhere i go i talk to everybody yeah well, that's it. Yeah. You, you are. You're ready then. You're ready to open, open mm. the gates. Yeah, like it was so random about like I, I was at like actually at a community center, and the guy who worked at the community center said, "You are so resourceful. You could actually work here." Like he's helping me look for a house, but I'm actually helping them with their job as well. And he's like, "Why don't you come and work with, come and work for us or with us?" 
And he was like, do this, get your Cert 3 in community services and come get a job because you're, like, pretty resourceful in helping people find houses and stuff because I've done everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I was like, definitely we'll be doing that. Yeah, but you, you, you've got so much still to look forward to. This is just yeah. like one of the challenges that you had to take on. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but it's how you how you deal with it now. Yeah. Mm, it's just how Not you deal with it. But you'll be fine. You'll be fine. You'll keep smiling. So you've got, like I say, you've got, if you, um, the Reiki master opens you up or, or you get your yeah. sister to help you, you, mm -hmm. you know, or how, when you feel comfortable, like I keep saying, you'll, you'll be fine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I definitely want to. Like, I want to do it now. <laughs> I'm gonna wait till I see the Reiki master and see how he helps. But he wants to meet beforehand, which I kind of was like, oh, that's a bit different. But I could. Mm. Yeah. Who says you couldn't teach somebody in the end? He told me that too. He said he was. He was like, you could be doing what I'm doing, and I was mm. like, all right. <laughs> <I'll live."> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, because I just suddenly got teacher with you as well. So, but you are you are something that a lot of people will look for in the future. Yeah, yeah. Well, I've done. I've I've been through a lot, and I've done a lot, and I've worked in many places. So I feel like I'm a resourceful type, and I, I could I do want to teach people because mm. of what I've learned throughout. You know, every experience that I've been through. Mm. Yeah, because I, yeah. I I I I get you giving out cards as well. Mm. I tell everyone that Business I've been card. through so much. I have like almost an answer for everything except for what I'm going through. <laughs> yeah, but it's always like that. You can always yeah. help anyone except yourself. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, but um, yeah, no, it's been fantastic having you on, Dana. Thank you so much for me. I hope no, you liked no. it. <laughs> yes, I hope you liked it. <laughs> and uh, it's been uh, fantastic having you on and uh, for you um, to give us that opportunity to do that reading for you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much. But, but, yeah, no, I hope that um, we haven't woken up your son. <laughs> no, once they're asleep, they're asleep, so I'm good now. Oh, okay, oh, that's good. That's good. <laughs> All yeah, right. Oh, um, there's a message here from Jackie for you. I'll just put it on. Jackie's from New Zealand, actually. I'm a bit too mean to get through to you. So just starting over all this. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah. And Jackie's a lovely lady as well. And we um, she says, when we go outside. <laughs> <laughs> No, but um, thank you um, for joining us. I'm going to let you go now. Thank uh, you. I'll let you go. So do you know how to do it on your phone or do you want me to do it from here? <laughs> oh, yeah, I can see the leave button, so just okay. leave. <laughs> All right, we're going to a big kiss from me and um, we'll, no, we'll uh, so you're, come and join us whenever because uh, even just okay. as you noticed, in the, everyone just chats to each other in the chat. Thank you so much. I'll jump back on the live. No worries. Bye. No, you take care of yourself and enjoy your sleep. Oh, yes. I definitely will have a good sleep tonight. And keep warm. <laughs> keep warm. See ya. See ya. <laughs> Bye. See ya later. Bye. Bye. Nice lady. Nice lady. Yeah. Oh, have you? Have I? No, Lisa Farley has a cardinal. That's been hanging out for months now. Okay. And Sarah Martin says she gives great advice, but does she take it? Oh, <laughs> uh, no, but, um, yeah, yeah, she's a lovely, lovely girl, wasn't she, Michelle? She definitely yeah. was. Mm. But um, it's come to that time now, <laughs> unfortunately. But uh, it's been lovely having everybody on and it was fantastic uh, that Dana came on for her reading. Um, 
we're actually going to be on again tomorrow night. And um, if you everyone would like to join us, it'll be fantastic. We'll be happy to have you on there. Um, Paul, would you like to say anything before we go? No, I just want to say thank you um, to each and every one of you. And Elmo seems to be coming on. Yeah, well, uh, Kailani's on. This is for Kailani. Hello, <laughs> Kailani. It's Elmo. Elmo loves you. You're most welcome, Dana. Jackie, has Kailani seen Elmo? Hi, Kailani. Oh, in the US? Um, okay. Uh, okay, well, I can tell you what time. It will be about... Good night, eight. Renee. Renee. Sorry? Good. Oh, no, good night, Renee. Renee. Yeah, we're on again tomorrow night, Renee. So, um, Lisa, it's 8 p.m. Melbourne time, Melbourne Australian time, and it is 11 a.m. UK time. So if you look on the time zones, the world time zones, so at the moment here, Lisa, it's in Melbourne, Australia, it is 10.22 p.m. on Thursday night. Oh, so she did see her, Jackie. Good. That's why I, I pulled. I, I wanted to say um, hi from Elmo. <laughs> yes. Yeah, the time that Michelle's got on there. So we'll actually be going on tomorrow, 8 p.m. Melbourne, Australia time. And, um, and that's what the time is now for us. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Kailani said, Oh, I love Elmo, Auntie. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, yeah. so it's 8.22 a.m. for you there, Lisa. Wow. Okay. So it might be too early for you in the morning. Um, so it'd be like two and a half hours. So, uh, 20, so past six, 20 past six in the morning. Yeah. How are you getting up early, Lisa? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think you can wake up early? <laughs> but... Um, did you say what you wanted to say, Paul? No, because Elmo interrupted. I'm sorry. All right, go ahead. <laughs> now, I, I was saying thank you very much to all the wonderful people that have turned up today, even the ones that have since gone. But thank you to all of them for all the shares, for all the, the great energies and everything. Thank you to all the people that we read. And thank you to Elmo. Uh, but thank we couldn't do this show without you. So thank you to each and every one of you. And thank you, Silvana, uh, for oh, what you do. Thank you, Paul. Yeah, thank you for what you do. You know, I don't know what it is, but no, thank you. No, I'm joking. No, thank <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> no, thank right. you for what you do. Thank yeah, you for what thank you do. Thank you, everyone. And, Come and everybody and join have a great, tomorrow everybody, night. Yes. Everybody, everybody have a great night or morning or whatever, yes. afternoon. Bye. Bye. Elmo says bye. Take care.